Everyone loves sandwiches, but let's be honest. The normal ingredients are just too healthy. In order to really maximize your flavor and your calories, just add about two pounds of Sour Patch Kids and you'll have a sandwich so good that not even Gordon Ramsay could resist it. Imagine that. We live in a country where you can buy two pounds of candy. For $3. <laughs> For $3. <laughs> would you eat that? Yes, I would eat that. So you won't Look eat a pickle, that. but you'd eat a grilled cheese made with Sour Patch Kids. Yeah, I'd rather die. This is probably one of the most useful hacks I've seen in a while. It's easy to do, it's practical, and cheap. You just make it a little funnel. Uh-huh. What else? And then you take your stick out so that way your funnel's not all sticky. Uh-huh. You put it in the lighter. No way this works. Oh, uh, so you need two Oh my gosh. Look at that, dude. What that, the heck? That's pretty cool. Say if you're lighting like a grill, this would be really helpful. You ever wondered what Milky Way looks like up close? Instead of becoming an astronaut like a normal person, just grab your stress ball and your favorite thousand degree knife and slice it into pieces. Oh wait, is that? I love, wait, that's ours. That's our stress ball, what the? No. No. Oh, that's no. my stress ball. It's so beautiful. <gasps> It looks good though. Dude, that's so cool. As you can see, this is exactly what the Milky Way looks like. Take that, Buzz Lightyear. We're watching a metal ball microwave. My guess is that literally nothing is going to happen. What's your guess? You don't think it's gonna like electrocute the microwave? No. Boom! No? Does it say it's 95 degrees Fahrenheit outside? Yeah, that's way too hot. Where are they at? <laughs> <laughs> They're in like... Well, it's 99 now. What the heck? Oh, maybe... Oh, maybe it's a microwave. It's probably because it's on a... Wow, we are really stupid. Yeah, microwaves are hot. Really hot. This is interesting. Dude, you can see the clouds reflecting off the timer. Can we just get a, a shot of the clouds? Because those are probably more interesting than this. <laughs> Open the microwave. It's 100 degrees. 101. Let's see how high it goes. 102. Oh, 102. 101. Oh, it's back down. 100. Oh, it's going down. down. Oh, man. Come on. Well, this is probably going to take a while, so we should probably check back in on it later, right? Yeah. Okay. It was a revolutionary idea to put a flashlight on phones. However, they made them too darn good. What if I only wanted to see a little circle of light? Well, with this new amazing technology, you can have the perfect amount of light when poking around in the dark. I guess it's kind of like a spotlight. Like, what if you were, like, short, shooting a short film and yeah. you want a spotlight on... Like, it adds distance, stuff. you know? Oh, look, my gummy bears. Ah! Oh, what's that? Oh, Revenge is... bear. I'm always so stressed out, and I would love to get a stress ball, but the idea of spending money on a stress ball stresses me out. Life is too hard. But lo and behold, this hack has come to save the day. Honestly, is there anything toothpaste can't do? You know, I've never seen a stress balloon sold anywhere, but I see them everywhere. Yeah, I've actually seen some of my friends have these. Yeah, you can make them. Some people, like, put, like, slime in them. This guy chose toothpaste. You just put it in your mouth and chew on it if you really want a minty freshness. Do you brush your teeth twice a day? No. I only brush mine once. Oh, you you're supposed to brush them once every three days. Are you serious? No. <laughs> That's not a smiley face. Because he's stressed. He doesn't want to smile when he's stressed. Almost everyone in the world drinks coffee, except for me. I'm not an idiot. Don't you hate when your coffee is scorching hot and you have to consistently blow and blow and just blow all over it? Blowing your coffee is so hard. Well, we have a solution for you. Just grab your everyday liquid nitrogen and pour it into your coffee. I wonder if that would alter the taste or if it just makes it cold? It would have to alter the taste. There's no You way. don't know that. Have you tried it? No. Yes. No. No. Drink it. Drink it. <laughs> Dude, I would be too scared to drink it. I would be so yeah, scared that like my tongue would just like... What if the cup froze <laughs> and it like just shattered in his hand? It's scary that that <laughs> substance just exists. Yeah. And you can just can buy, buy it. it. Jinx. Now that we all use phones and computers, I never write anything down. So I have a lot of unused pens laying around. But I can never throw them away because they're so special to me. One of them I borrowed in fifth grade and never returned. So to store them in a neat manner, just do a little surgery on a Coke bottle, put a little bit of hot glue, and now your desk will be perfectly in order. I watched this one earlier, and you know what I thought to myself? What was that? They missed an opportunity. You cut the base off. Oh, I and see. And then you glue it, and it, dude, it would have made yeah. a perfect Grape oh, juice glass. Yeah, great. excuse me, grape juice glass. You'd have tons of disposable grape juice glasses for your family and friends. Exactly. Look at that. That's a perfect grape juice glass. Have you ever wanted to freeze your Orbeez? Well, why not? Just turn a can of air upside down and spray the Orbeez. Boom. Frozen. Hey, my brother put 100 million of those in a backyard. My brother ate a sandwich full of Orbeez. Wow. It actually froze it. That's yeah. pretty cool. It looks, like a yellow, it looks like a yellow cherry. It looks like a war is breaking out between the Orbeez and the straw. Oh, you know those black, those bracelets that used to have like little beads and then and one of them was black and then it has mud from the lowest so it's like no matter if you're high or low you always be blah, blah, blah. that's what, what it, does it look like what will you always be you always be a star all right and we're back 
looks like some time's flown by. It's a nice camera in the reflection. Yeah, I can kind of It went down it. all the way to 69 degrees. Nice. I'm surprised the microwave just wouldn't stop. Yeah. Why can microwaves go up to 99 minutes? Your microwave should just be like, no, stop. Use an oven, idiot. Who is microwaving something for nine minutes unless it's like a potato? Who microwaves a potato? You don't microwave potatoes to make baked potatoes? All right, I'm gonna learn you. Well, I don't is... cook. Oh, wait, they did something. Hold <laughs> wait, on. Wait, Rewind it back, Turbo. They opened it, I swear to God. Chris, you're seeing things. Oh, oh there it is. They cleaned it? I guess they cleaned it or something. I don't know. Anyways, I can't tell if the light's on or if that's a fire. That's gotta be a fire, right? Yeah, because it wasn't like that before. We'll come back to this later. Ice is nice, but you know what is terrible? Women. <laughs> Just kidding. So I decided to play God and make my eyes instantly. With this revolutionary trick, I will someday conquer the world. Oh, oh wow. wow. He's making an ice tray. Ice tray to get. Oh, <laughs> oh, how convenient. They didn't fall everywhere. You know it's really good? What? When you freeze a drink right to the point where it's like a slushy. I wonder if that's toxic or not. That's you say totally that's toxic? toxic. You're literally toxic. I said totally. You're literally toxic though. Thanks. Choosing snacks is hard. I mean, I don't want to have to decide between chips and dips or Sour Patch Kids. So instead of choosing, here's how to make a device that will hold all your snacks at one time. Dude, this would be great if I had parties, but you know, literally no one ever comes over to my house ever. Except for me. Yeah, and I don't like you, so I don't know why you come over. I don't either. I think it's my cat. I love your cat. Layers of snacks. Yeah, um, dude, he's making literally like, dude, we paid $50 for one of these things, like a real one. We could have made it with like $4. Yeah, that's actually pretty cool. Oh, that's a bold choice. Okay. I don't know about that. He ate it. Have you ever been in a fight with your pet monkey and you really want to teach him a lesson? Well, just grab his favorite banana and pour liquid nitrogen all over it. Don't mess with me. I mess with your banana. And we're freezing it. That doesn't, I hope they're not wearing open-toed shoes because that stuff was splashing, bro. Dude, I hope this banana just shatters. Oh, oh look at yeah. That. Dude, the, look water at the water running off. It's literally off. dancing. Oh my wow. God, dude, it's rock It's a hockey solid. puck. Smash it. Smash it. Smash it. Oh, <laughs> it wasn't as hard as I thought. I this is not like, yeah, dip it in there. Dip a banana in there. There, there you, you go. go. Oh, yeah. Just let it sit there for a while. Pour it all out. Oh, that's hard. That's going to shatter. Yeah. Listen to that. Listen that to sounds it. like glass. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh there it is. That's what we wanted. Banana ice cubes. Can you eat stuff that's frozen in liquid nitrogen? I don't know. Because I've heard of like people eating liquid nitrogen cockroaches. What? Yeah, no joke. All right, and we are back with another metal ball in a microwave. It's currently 6, 20, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Uh, we got a lot of action here coming up on the home front. Uh, the metal ball is doing a lot of stuff. Uh, we're actually pretty excited to what he, see what he can do this year. So let's see. Let's, let's go live to the action right now. <coughs> wow, that is in entertaining. All right, and we'll check back in with the metal ball. We'll be back after these brief life hacks. Ooh, that's that Walmart drinking water, the best water ever. It's that Walmart cup too. Until you buy it at a football game, it's all of a sudden $10. All right. <laughs> Are you the weird guy that always hangs out in the corner at parties, but conveniently always has your sister's nail polish in your back pocket? Dude, Ooh. this would have been so much cooler if they used clear nail polish. Hi, sisters. Just whip that sucker out, pour it on someone's drink, and light it on fire. Everyone will be amazed and forget that you don't have any social skills whatsoever. Hi. Whoa, that would be cool if it was clear nail polish. Dude, there's literally water in the spit on that and it would go out. Men were given a natural fire hose to put out fires. Just pull down your pants and pee on it. Hey right, Chandler, it's competition of the races. I mean, <laughs> I mean, I mean it's a race, but what? that came out wrong. Okay, we're gonna run that back. It's competition of the balls. Who is going to win, do you think? The basketball. You know, honestly, I think the green machine's got it. Really? Yeah, so his stats this year have been a little higher. He's having a couple more rebounds than the basketball, so uh. we'll see. Oh, look at him go, oh, they're fighting. Out oh, now. This is like smash oh yellow's Walker. getting killed. Who's going first? Oh. oh, green and yellow are not looking good. No, they are not. Oh, oh the basketball's the gone. The holding on. Oh, no. And it's gone. The soccer ball the is soccer the ball winner. Win. Soccer finally did something. Wow. It's still not a good sport, but it, it won this. <laughs> That's going to make a lot of people mad. Yeah. And both of us used to play soccer, too. Uh, yeah. Here goes again, brutalizing a bottle cap. I'm tired of seeing bottle caps. <laughs> We need a revolt. Anytime you guys see a bottle cap, I want you guys to complain in the comment section. If you are among the few people who don't know how to use a fork, our nation's greatest scientists have come up with a way to make using forks easier. All you have to do is cut up bottle caps and stick some forks in between the cuts and boom. You know what this would be great for? Chopsticks. Pick picking up grapes. And uh, we did a video where we ate golden steak and at the first place I was using chopsticks and I was using little helper things on the end and people were making fun of me. You're a man. You should know how to use chopsticks. You watch anime. Can we go to the next one? I feel attacked. <laughs>
Ooh, that's good granulated sugar there. Dude, when I was a kid, I used to sneak into the kitchen and just eat spoonfuls of sugar. Dude, I used to grab the whole thing of sugar and pour it on my Cheerios. Dude, look at, oh my God, what it is like that? looks like tar. Oh. You know why the sugar turned black though? Why? It caramelized. Oh, thanks. The more you know. <laughs> Back for round four. Metal Ball, how are you doing? Well, look at the bike. What is it doing? Glitch. Dude, I, I'm literally like entertained. What is it doing? Dude. Told you, man. It's about that time he it's does magic. something. It's magic. Two. One. Yeah. Buzzer beater. 10.26. That is exactly 10 hours. And he made it. I burnt a small hole in the microwave. That's cool, I guess. <laughs> Whoa, All right. Well, glad that? somebody took 10 hours of their day to do that. A lot of cucumbers are left uncut each year, but with this simple DIY cucumber cutter, you can make sure all your cucumbers are safe and healthy. We are saving cucumbers one cut at a time. What's he doing? He's making a triangle. Oh, so you cut into the back of it? That looked dangerous. This looks dangerous. Just a little bit. Dude, aluminum cans are so sharp. I know, dude. Oh, Whoa. Look. Wow, they definitely did not just put slices in there. Yeah, this is real. That's the realest thing I've seen. And we are back with sound effects <laughs> and description by Chris and Chandler. Pot. Coke. Coke. Open. Sesame. Pour. In the pot. Don't drink. No, yet. no, no. Get rid of pot. Boom. Gone. Two empty bottles. Razor. Cut, 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 cut. Other bottle. Cut, 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 cut. Cut, cut. Two half bottles connected. Now, tape. Label, label. Label, label. More duct tape, 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 duct tape. tape. <laughs> Secure the bag. Pot is back. Scoop the Coke. Scoop, scoop. Pour into two half bottle connection. Pour, 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 pour. Appears to be leaking. <laughs> Commence leaking. <laughs> and we're done. Thank you. That was sound effects and description by Chris and Chandler. That's good TP right there. That's at least 17 ply. That's uh, that's Charmin. I can tell by looking at the paper. Is this knife even hot? That's like a lukewarm knife. You know when you're on the toilet and the explosive diarrhea you get from eating all that Taco Bell the night before is just a little too much to handle? Your new and improved toilet paper has no choice but to help cool down your butthole. It's like icy hot but for your butt. That actually looks cool. Zoom in on the like the flame. That is toilet paper on fire. If you haven't seen it, you've seen it now. That's it for the video. We're about to play rock, paper, scissors. Remember, Whenever you click on a Mr. Period Beast video, always watch to the end. Because at the end of every video, we play rock, paper, scissors. People that don't play rock, paper, scissors, their parents don't love them. So, get your get your thing in your hand. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. I chose paper, you chose rock, take an L. All right, for this next one, I choose rock. Whoa. Wow, I can't believe you've done this. All right, we're tied. This one's for the dub. Rock, paper, Scissors, shoot! Well, that was super easy. Subscribe or you're a failure.